Well, the Justice Department is suing DirecTV over its negotiations over carriage of Sportsnet LA, which is the Dodgers' own TV channel, which has left much of Los Angeles unable to watch the Dodgers play for the past three seasons. Now, the Justice Department alleges DirecTV was the ringleader in a plan to make sure that three other pay TV companies would refuse to carry the sports channel. The alleged violation occurred before AT&T bought DirecTV last year. The suit does come on the heels of AT&T announcing its $84 billion deal for Time Warner, a deal that will need Justice Department approval. Now, the lawsuit filed today is not related to that coming regulatory process, but it certainly seems like it wouldn't help. Guys, back over to you. So this is a, a, basically an accusation about colluding, essentially, correct, Julia? Which means, and the victim here is the company that didn't get as much money or any money like they should have. Exactly. This is an allegation about colluding, and the reason why DirecTV is singled out is because the Department of Justice says that even though there were conversations among four different pay TV distributors, the Department of Justice calls DirecTV the ringleader in this situation. Hey, CNBC fans, thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Here you're going to find videos packed with all of the information that you need to be smarter about your finances. You can subscribe by clicking right here and click on all the videos around me or the eye right here to watch the latest from CNBC. Thanks for watching.